Hi guys, you may have seen some of my charity shop gold or garbage videos that I've picked up some of these uh, four wheel drive cars. I say four wheel drive, they're um, geared so that the front and the back wheels are linked together so they all drive at the same time. There's an electric motor in the middle, Wurm gears pointing forwards and backwards and they turn the axles. It's just a single battery in there. Single AA battery. And as I say, drives both front and back at the same time. This one's just the same. And the reason I bought them is Burhan Seifula makes lots of little walking robots using the components from these cars. In fact, if I can get this one apart, I think I'll use this one straight away. our motor. I won't bother taking it apart any further because I don't need to. What I'm going to do is stand it on its end. Oh, I took the battery out didn't I? See, it's almost trying to walk as it is. All I'm going to do is put some little pegs sticking out from each wheel, attach a leg to it. Um, let's see what I've got. Something like a coffee stirrer or a popsicle stick. And we'll go down there, put some nice um, U-shaped feet on the bottom that help it to balance and it should walk along. I'll put links in my video description to Burhan's channel because he makes really nice ones. But I'll just make as simple as possible just to see if I can make it work. I found a couple of popsicle sticks so those will do for the legs and I've got some galvanized wire which is usually used in the garden for tying things up. So it's relatively soft so you can bend it quite easily. I'm not going to show you the full build video because it's basically a copy of Burhan's work so I want you to watch his videos to see how to do it properly. But I'm going to drill some holes directly in these wheels glue some, uh, I'll probably put some little wire um, pegs in there to stick out so that I can attach the legs to it. Well there we are, nothing like as neat and tidy as one of Burhan's robots. Well, it's working. So the general principle works, but I think you need to study Burhan's work to learn how to do it properly. So that's my 
tribute to Burhan Saifullah. He does excellent work.